Ever pondered why March brims with a distinct aura of empowerment, celebration, and acknowledgement of women's contributions throughout history? An intriguing question indeed. Today, we delve into the origins and significance of Women's History Month, a global celebration of women's accomplishments across various spheres of life. Journey back in time to 1978 in the United States to a school district in Sonoma, California. Here, a week-long event was organized to celebrate women's contributions to culture, history, and society. This event, known as Women's History Week, marked the inception of what we now celebrate as Women's History Month. Just two years later, in February of 1980, President Jimmy Carter issued the first presidential proclamation, declaring the week of March 8 as National Women's History Week. This week corresponded with International Women's Day, which is celebrated globally on March 8. The baton of progress didn't halt there. By 1987, the National Women's History Project successfully petitioned Congress to expand the celebration to the entire month of March. The United States Congress passed Public Law 109, officially designating March as Women's History Month. This was a significant milestone in acknowledging the roles of women in shaping history. Fast forward to the present day, Women's History Month is celebrated not only in the United States, but across the globe. It serves as a beacon reminding us of the extraordinary achievements of women in various fields, often in the face of adversity. It is a time to reflect on the trailblazing women who led the way for change, breaking barriers and making history. From the suffragettes to the women's liberation movement, from the first woman in space to the first woman head of state, Women's History Month celebrates them all. It's a time to remember those who fought for women's rights and those who continue to fight for equality and justice. In essence, Women's History Month is a tribute to the generations of women who have proved invaluable to society. It's a testament to their resilience, courage and unwavering spirit. To recap, Women's History Month had its humble beginnings as a week-long celebration in a school district in Sonoma, California, in 1978. It gained national recognition in the United States in 1980 when President Jimmy Carter issued the first presidential proclamation. The month-long celebration came into effect in 1987 after the National Women's History Project successfully petitioned Congress. Today, Women's History Month is a global celebration that pays homage to the countless women who have shaped history, fought for equality, and continue to inspire future generations. It's a time to reflect, to learn, and to appreciate the indomitable spirit of women around the world. So the next time March rolls around, remember the journey, the struggles, the victories, and the extraordinary women whose footprints have left an indelible mark on the sands of time. Because every step forward is a step closer to a world where gender equality is not an aspiration, but a reality.